Hi everybody, it is Wednesday the 20th. This is Mr. Cadenhead. I'm coming to you a few days early because uh, this Friday, which is full celebration, is going to be really busy and so there's a good chance um, I won't be able to get a video out to all of you and many of you are leaving town probably shortly after school that day anyway. And so uh, I have a lot of important reminders for you today. Again, Wednesday the 20th. Uh, the rest of this week is going to be a really busy week. Uh, a couple things I want to outline is the play is tonight, Wednesday night, Romeo and Juliet, if you haven't seen it. Um, it is getting probably some of the best reviews of any play that, that I've certainly been around in the last 10 years here at Folsom High School. So I hear it's outstanding. I'm going tomorrow night, uh, Thursday night, so it's 7 o'clock. Um, and it also is Friday and Saturday night. So Saturday night is the last performance. Make sure you go see that. Um, Thursday night, also on campus, 5.30 to 8 p.m. is our art show. One of my absolute, if not the favorite thing we do all year long um, is that Thursday night, and that is open to the public. So parents, um, friends, family members, etc., cetera, um, neighbors, whoever, can all come to that Thursday night event uh, here on campus. And then Friday is our full celebration. Uh, and both Thursday night and Friday, we've got ceramics, digital art, drawing, painting. Um, we actually have engineering and manufacturing this year displays going on as well. And so uh, all day Friday, really, we'll be setting up first thing in the morning, but um, our students will be able with some teachers going out and able to tour the artwork. It is going to be a little bit challenging this year because it is uh, probably gonna rain a little bit on Friday. Hopefully it holds off a little bit for us, but we also wanna be really respectful and careful around the artwork, especially some of the ceramics, breakables, etc. cetera, uh, because probably with it raining, we're gonna to wanna to stay indoors and just be cautious around those things. But it's always incredible to see the talent of our students, your peers at Folsom High School. It is incredible, and so please enjoy that day. Um, also want to remind you that spring break starts then that evening and we will be back on Monday, April 1st. It is important to note we are back that Monday just because of the way the calendar fell this year. We, we don't have that Monday off and we've had that off in the past. So we are in school April 1st, Monday, April 1st. Um, also want to emphasize a couple things heading into the last quarter. One, if you can help me please, we just don't have the capacity to handle outside food deliveries. So uh, any of the food delivery companies, it's a safety issue for us. They end up wandering campus looking for students um, and we just don't have the capacity to run that to students in any reasonable time. So um, we do accommodate parents when you drop off food or your parent drops off food for you. Um, we are committed to doing that um, and they can text and let you know to come up and get it but we are not accepting deliveries at Folsom High School, and I don't want you to lose out on your money, but please don't have things delivered to the site. Um, want to make sure that you emphasize, we emphasize attendance as we get back from spring break. Um, I know people get sick, I get it, but if you can be here, be here, it will lower your stress, help you prepare for our finals, uh, which will be very quickly here in May. Um, we don't have a lot of time left, so you want to make sure you're here, you're on top of things. We'll talk maybe next time about studying and strategies for that. Make sure you're really, really intentional about how you're using your pause days. So plan those ahead. Travel to the appropriate place and know what activity you're going to take care of. And if you're going to go get help from a teacher, let that teacher know you're coming. That way you can be super efficient with that use. So uh, it is a really busy time of the year. Seniors, make sure you are dialed in and senior parents if you're listening really dialed into all the dates, times, practices, your senior web page, uh, your C senior Google classroom, all of that sort of thing. So you know all those activities coming up. May 11th, senior ball, all of that stuff. Super important, you're ready with your cap, gown, and whatnot. So I hope everybody is doing really well. Uh, it's been a great couple of weeks and let's have a great full celebration and art show and play. Uh, also quick, uh, good luck to our Akadeka heads off to the state competition tomorrow Thursday so good luck at that level that's always impressive um, and uh, good luck to our choir traveling to New York next week uh, to or this weekend rather to perform at Carnegie Hall that's amazing and uh, we will also when we get back start celebrating our academic awards so our ninth through 12th grade classes will be in the theater during pause 
and we will be celebrating GPA as well as our Bulldog Pride Award, which is based upon our guiding principles, and those are chosen by our teachers. So we will be hosting all of those grade levels in the theater, and I will be reading names and recognizing your hard work. So we appreciate all of you. So have a great break, and even though it's not Friday, read a good book without pictures, have a passion for something positive, make sure over the break, many times you tell your family you love them, and our key word is always balance. Thank you.